Alrighty, um, I was having difficulty connecting my computer and light burn to this laser and it determined that um, I needed an older version. I had a newest version of light burn, which I have a license for, but apparently that's a hobbyist, um, not a Ruida license, not a DSP, so I had to buy a new license to get that to work. Finally I got it to work and I was able to run a file from my computer to the laser. This is a um, welcome mat that I just designed using a Radiant logo. This is not for sale. I, you know, this is, you know, that's a trademark. <laughs> that's protected. I do not sell these. Um, I'm not licensed to. This is for my own personal use because I am a Ravens fan. So I'm um, just testing the system on floor mats to see what it does. If you notice up in the very top, there's a very dark spot. That was my diode laser trying to do this, and it just burned. Um, and it just burned. So I'm hoping that the uh, when it does the actual image of the Raven, it will cover that up. Uh, but this is going to go on my back deck. So I just wanted to see how well this would actually gray, engrave a, a mat, and it seems to be doing a pretty good job. All right, shut down the system. I'm gonna let it smoke clear out for a few more minutes, but there it is. That was up. There it is, uh, 22 minutes total, battery's dying. Here you go.